Band Show. You really loved him. I did, yeah. yeah. He was my brother. And that's why that's Good why the band me. had to end when he died, because mm-hmm. he was the heart and soul for you, right? Well, he was a good part of it. He was also, um, you know, he was a loose cannon, but he was a spectacular guy. He was a, a good-hearted man. Are you fierce? He helped me a lot. Are you fiercely uh, anti-alcohol and drugs because of what it did to the band? No. Because it, it sort no, of... No, I'm not. I'm I, not I, drugs I have no interest in. Right. Never but, did. Did I did a little bit, yeah. But it, it got in the way of joy. Right. And and when Jimmy got into drugs and, and Bonzo was <clears throat> alcohol in and up, that had to be um, life draining to you in, yeah. in a sense. I mean, because then then you lose the spirit of what it is you got into this for. What happened to me was this sort of thing. I was in a car wreck in um, the mid seventies, and I was in a wheelchair for seven months. And um, you had to stop a tour, right? Uh, yeah. Did well, you feel to... guilty because you, you kind of like kept the band <laughs> off the road for a year? Was that a tremendous no, no, pressure? We, no, no, of course you can't feel guilty about being nearly dead. Right. Um, Your wife was driving the car at the time mm. and it was a terrible car. I remember thinking like you were dead. I remember because, mm. you know, you read these things. They didn't have the Internet at that point. It was very, well, very blessing, confusing. Yeah. Yeah. Now you had to wait for the paper to come from Greece. Yeah. Right. Yeah. It took forever. But, but, but the deal was, my yeah. point is <clears throat> that when you've been out of the the game when you can't drive a car when you can't get in the bathtub when you can't do anything why waste the second of time you know after that life became precious right. you knew how yeah. yeah would you try to say to bonzo or jimmy hey guys that life is precious what are you doing to yourselves we, we have this great career going we have music we have wealth now we well, have everything no it, well wealth is is as much as it is material it's also a condition of the mind you know so you've got to be actually you have to have your own internal wealth uh and it has to be built in not sort of jammed in there and we never ever their lives their own free time was their own free time and it always was like that and that was one of the reasons why we actually did maintain some sanity throughout the real crazy days because we didn't spend all that time we didn't live together off the road or anything like that. I used to see Bonzo a lot, but we'd just be in the pub, you know. Um, so It's probably healthier, right? Because well, if you yeah. spend that much time together, you become, you become aggravated with one another. Your personalities start to clash. Maybe. Yeah. yeah. You know, also, I mean, geographically, me and Bonzo lived where we always lived. Right. And so that was that. So I didn't follow anybody's private lives. The Howard Stern Show.